Why are you paying five figures for a video game console? If you want to win a gaming gift card to your platform of choice, all you gotta do is leave a comment on this video, picking a random video upload in the month of November to the channel, live on twitch.tv slash crew at the end of the month. So get those comments on all the videos uploaded in the month of November for more chances to win. Follow me on twitch.tv slash crew. Uh, to, to, for chances to win there. Two winners picked from Twitch and YouTube. There you go. Even a winner on Twitter. So go check out Twitter as well for the pinned tweet. How to win. More, a lot of chances to win. Go win. I don't know. Maybe. Oh, hope you do. Today it's me and Dob. Okay. Well, Dobby's gone. <laughs> that was that was fast. The Xbox Series X and the PlayStation 5 are out. They're out in the world. They're out in the wild. Woo! It's been a wacky, wild ride, baby. And here they are. And here you don't have one because they are being scalped out the ass. This is the weirdest thing I've ever seen with any console release ever. Obviously, at the beginning of pretty much every major console release, there's always some scarcity. There's always scalpers. With the, Even the Wii U had scalpers, all right? This, this happens every console generation. But this time is a whole nother beast, maybe because of COVID. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know what's really to blame. I don't know, maybe it's the companies doing some false scarcity. Uh, who knows? Okay, there could be a lot of things here. There's obviously a lot of factors, but I wanted to rant and rave about some outrageous, ridiculous, uh, outlandish shit, really, that I'm seeing uh, in the scalping arena. Uh, and people, the prices that people are paying for these consoles is un literally unbelievable. Uh, there are Xbox Series X and PlayStation 5s getting scalped for five digits. We're talking tens of thousands of dollars in the case of the PlayStation 5. Tens! Uh, I saw Xbox Series X is going for maximum over 10 grand. Uh, and I saw PlayStation 5s going for over $20,000 for a PlayStation 5 abundity. Just of games and controllers. They're like nothing. I don't know, it's not worth that much. You add it up and it's gonna be like, oh, this is worth like 1,500 bucks. Tops, max. I literally saw PlayStation 5s, just the console selling for five digits. And I'm just like, who is buying this? First of all, there are a ton available for, for less than two grand. You type in PlayStation 5 on, on eBay, you're gonna get a lot of like $1,500 listings, $1,600 listings. For the most part, they're selling for about 1,000 to 1,200 bucks on average PlayStation 5. Xbox Series X is a little lower. Uh, maybe because there's less interest, like I stated before, there probably would be less interest. Uh, those are going for about 800 to 1000 on average, but again, I saw those going for over 10000 even bids. Obviously, that could be some type of money laundering sketchiness. There's a lot of sketchy stuff that goes on on eBay. They could be like, hey, Vinny, buy my Xbox for $10,000. We can clean that money up. You know what I mean? I don't know. Maybe it's something like that. That was a terrible mobster voice. Uh, I'm not going to be hired by Quentin Tarantino anytime soon, that's for sure. Uh, but if these are legitimate sales, who is buying? Like, maybe they're filtering nearest first to their house. They want the Xbox that much. Like, I'll pay $10,000. It's right down the street from me. Here you go. I'm a millionaire. I don't give a heck. But why do you even want an Xbox Series X or a PlayStation 5 at this point in their life? They have nothing. What do you want to, you want to pay $1,000 to play Spider-Man or Demon Souls Remake? Like, what? Who cares? Who cares at all? I saw Woods made a video. I was like, PlayStation 5 is my new favorite console. I'm like, there's two games. Jesus Christ, Woods! God! Why are you lying? Good to get the clicks, but that's fine. I understand the hustle. Uh, <laughs> obviously, I'm just being outrageous and bombastic and fantastic. Hopefully fantastic in your eyes. I mean, I'm hoping. Uh, but a lot of these are scalpers. The people, they use bots. They use bots to buy these. I wanted to talk about the bot situation. I have had multiple friends trying to get their hands on a PlayStation 5. Walmart's been doing little weird restocks randomly. Like, oh, we're restocking in an hour! <laughs> and then it sells out within like a second and the website crashes. That's because of bots. Real human beings are trying, but they cannot defeat the bots. I have had multiple friends trying, seriously, at least three off the top of my head I can remember, saying, man, I've been trying to get a PlayStation 5 uh, all day, today, yesterday, not happening. Uh, it's just not gonna happen. Uh, a lot of stores aren't even gonna have these in stock physically in the store until 2021. Best Buy, most notably, which I talked about before. It's a fiasco. This is a fucking fiasco for like uh, the biggest I've ever seen for any console video game launch. It blows my mind. Just just build a PC. If you're gonna spend a thousand dollars on a fucking PlayStation 5, just build a goddamn gaming PC. Like Jesus Christ, what are you? I saw digital PlayStation 5s going for a thousand dollars. I'm just like, are you crazy? Are you out of your mind? You wanna get fucked that hard? Jesus Christ! I hope they brought lube! Because that is one rough fucking baby.
Uh, I hope none of you are partaking in 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 this, uh, buying double, paying double the price, upwards of th three times the price, sometimes even fucking astronomically higher, fucking what, five times five five hundred. Uh, I don't even know how much. It's a lot. It's fucking twenty five thousand dollars is ridiculous numbers that only Elon Musk or somebody can afford. I don't know. I don't know what's. It just it blows my mind. This whole thing blows my mind. I'm blown away. I wanted to rant and rave about it. How is this happening in gaming with these consoles? Obviously, like I said, maybe it's COVID, maybe, who knows, maybe false scarcity, but this should be sorted out. The regular average consumer that wants to buy a product from Sony should be able to buy that product um, and not have to pay fucking scalpers online. And I don't fault the scalpers. They're out there hustling for that money and there's suckers uh, that will pay the money. I'm not, I'll wait because like I said, I don't give a fuck to play Spider-Man or Team It Souls. <laughs> Uh, so I can wait a couple months. It's gonna be all right, guys. If you have to wait till 2021, it's not gonna be the end of the world. My God, most of the games came to PlayStation 4 anyways. There's not gonna be that anything that anything that amazing until then. Spider-Man probably is pretty amazing. The, the first one was really, really cool. But, it, you know, it'll be cheaper by then anyways. You can get the discount $20 version. Boom. It's a win-win for you and everybody. Maybe not the scalpers if you choose not to partake. So there you go. I don't know. I just wanted to go on a rant. I like to rant and I like to yell. You know what? There's not much else going on in gaming other than... Oh, the new shiny consoles are here! Ha <laughs> ha! And that's it. So, uh, sorry, I've been absent a little bit, but I made a lot of videos last week. I made videos on, uh, like, four different channels. I think I made, like, seven videos. I don't know if you guys follow those. We had a wrestling channel, Wesley, Bre Wexley Break and the Lawson. I got a VOD channel, uh, Bubby MLG, where I upload my Twitch VODs, make gameplays from Twitch, about to go live stream tonight, some more Resident Evil, playing that. I also have Bubby's World, where I upload a new video there, my other channel where I do skit stuff not related to video games. Been doing a lot of stuff, a lot, and, uh, so, excuse, even outside of YouTube as well, so excuse me for the lack of videos on the channel this week, but this next week, I'm going to try to make it up to you guys and get a video out every day. Hopefully, don't hold me to that, goddammit. Like I said, I'm going to be making videos for other channels as well, so we'll see what we can do juggling a lot of things here. I love you guys so much, so you know, you know, you know that. I'm looking right at you. You know, sitting right there. I see you. I know you know. But if you want to support the channel, we have a merch store, fugamecrew.bigcartel.com. We got shirts, stickers, mugs, all that fun stuff. Go quality, fashion, we got pricing. For those of dollar a month, you can help support us on Patreon, patreon.com slash fugamecrew. We also have a join button down below. It's like Patreon through YouTube. Uh, it's, all those are great ways to support the channel. Uh, you can support us by liking, commenting, subscribing, all that fun stuff. And uh, links to everything in the description. Uh, my other channels, like I said, all the other channels are in the description besides the re West wrestling one. We'll, we'll put that one in there eventually. Wex breaking the loss in uh, so there you go. Uh, we're also on bit shoot and uh, go check us over there and I'll see you later. So I want to say thank you to your loyalty. Thank you for your support. Burr!